Hello everyone, encouragement video for February 2024. Purpose, part two. Since I shared about this topic last month, I've been thinking more about it and asking people around me. Many people are searching for it. What on earth am I here for? What is the meaning of life? Why do I feel empty? Why do we need to have a purpose? I was impressed with some of the sous chef's answers. They told me that purpose gives them a sense of direction, it shapes goal, and guides life decisions. What is your life purpose? I believe that each one of us has different and unique purposes and dreams. My mom told me yesterday that without a purpose, I have no reason to live. My dear friend Farah said, to love, not judge people around me, and to provide for my family and do good on earth to serve God on this short earthly life in hopes of a better in eternity through Him. Very deep. JM, my friend, who is an international speaker and the host of the Let's Go Win podcast, said, inspiring people to live their best lives. What an inspiring purpose to live on. Mario, my fellow restaurateur said, my purpose is to create new opportunities for people while God blessed me with them being in our life. No wonder he continues to open Mario's early toast all over town. I even asked Sakura, a 14-year-old girl who has a dream to be playing golf professionally someday. She said, my purpose is to make sure of what God has provided and supported me with to share and grow in spirit to reflect what God has done for me. She doesn't have selfish ambition, but the ambition of something much greater. How about one more? Del Carson, who is the founder of The Sleep Train, is not just a great friend, but he's one of the most generous human beings I know. He also said that he wants to use the talent that God gave him to help others. His company is an official model. I don't know if, I, if it's okay to share it, but we make money to give it away. He inspires me and challenges me at the same time. Here are things that might help to find it if you don't have it yet. One, recognizing your distinct and unique personality traits. Two, engaging with your potential talent and ability. Three, operating in the area of your passion. Four, acting on a burden that consumes you. Once I comprehend that I have limited time on earth, it automatically causes me to get my priorities right. I have to learn to focus on the majors instead of the minors. Being Purposefully, purposeful involves living life with the awareness of what you will leave behind, your legacy. The greatest legacy is, isn't net worth or real estate or trophies, but the impact we made. If you're not living out your unique purpose, it does not matter what else you achieve, accomplish, or establish during the time and space we call life. You have been handpicked, appointed, and com commissioned by the Maker Himself to be fruitful. You have been chosen to live your purpose. Come on, let's do it. Purpose.